In the face of unimaginable tragedy, one man found the strength to turn his pain into purpose. Tonight, we're going to share the story of Justin Baxley and his powerful initiative, More Than a Number, which is transforming the way we here at 11 Alive honor victims, support families, and, and preserve the legacies of those lost to violent crime. You've got a family who's grieving, who's probably going through the worst day of their life. The last thing they may want to do right now is talk. There was a lack of empathy and a lack of compassion for what I had gone through. Each victim is more than a number. What are your hopes for this program, More Than a Number? I just hope that folks use it. It's a powerful tool to make sure that your voice is heard and you can give a face to your loved one. They do become more than a statistic. More than a number. They are more than a number. My pain is enormous, don't get me wrong. It brings some comfort to a situation that it's very rare to find comfort. This is him in all his glory uh, out uh, cooking for his friends. He loved to cook. In Macon, Georgia, Justin Baxley's dad was number 27. That pain doesn't end. It's, it's, a, it's a constant. Justin is the digital content manager at our sister station, WMAZ in Macon. I really enjoy just helping people. In 2017, his father, 53-year-old Michael Baxley, was gunned down in his home during a robbery. The house was entered forcibly. It's a gruesome crime scene. It's gruesome. A Bibb County Sheriff's captain broke the news. She said, Justin, we found your dad dead. And my life changed in that moment. He says he was bombarded with calls from local reporters. Within two hours of me finding out, I'd received five phone calls asking for interviews. And I would say, I'm not ready yet. And they'd call back an hour later, are you ready now? And you wouldn't believe what he had to go through next. While still grieving the horrific murder of his father, he had to go to his house and clean up that gruesome crime scene. Unless I had $1,200, we weren't going to get somebody out there to clean up. He's been through so much, and to turn that around into a positive is just amazing. That pain became his purpose. We've got 61 so far. To honor his dad, he launched the More Than a Number website in Macon. It honors lives lost to violent crime. I didn't know there is crime scene sanitation. Supports their loved ones with resources and works with law enforcement to build a safer, more compassionate community. The project is an opportunity to change some things in the way that we cover tragedies. Family and friends can share stories, photos, and memories of their loved ones here. Growing up, he'd have like a Mustang or something, so it was always fun to go out with dad. I would think that this has not been easy for you. I'll never forget the first workshop I did. The minute that the, the camera cut off from me, I mean, I was in tears. Justin even holds workshops for news organizations emphasizing the victim over the story. It's some of the hardest things I've ever had to do is get in front of my peers and basically tell them like, hey, we're doing this the wrong way. We should try something else. With your dad, his legacy is living on and not just in your life, but in the stories of others. My dad is no longer uh, number 27. He's not just a, a victim. By the way, uh, we here at 11 Alive, we are here for you as you navigate through any tragic loss. We're here to support your family during this difficult time. So we are now working to connect with various nonprofit organizations and law enforcement agencies to collaborate on getting you the support that you desperately need. To see our resource guide or to share a loved one you want us to remember, just go to 11alive.com slash more than a number.